this. Um, what is this about? Metamodernism is about having different personas. Um, to be honest, I'm a little bit uncomfortable right now. But I'm having this persona, I'm putting up this front. There's a distance between me and who I really am and this um, video. There's a distance between me and the words I'm saying and also even further in how it's coming across in a video. I'm essentially acting out the thoughts that are in my brain that are um, not even really definable, not even really tangible. And it's even more of a front right now because I feel like people can hear me and it makes me uncomfortable. But at the end of the day, it's just a persona. In fact, I've come to realize all of these videos I do um, sort of has a certain persona. Um, and through watching them too, I understand the persona that um, I develop when I'm filming and then also try and recreate that um, while I'm filming, sometimes while I'm talking, but usually just about this subject. All of a sudden, when I talk about this subject, I become a different person. But um, would be interesting is to have my videos in conjunction with somebody else's videos about the subject. It's like actually trying to explain this philosophy to people, but understanding all the completely different ways that you um, communicate it and how that's really like part of your persona, your thing. So if I had to say it's about one thing, I'm gonna continue with the both and because that's kind of what this is all about, even though I don't want to keep saying both and because then it directs me towards a specific philosophy of metamodernism. In fact, because a lot of this too is not even about a thing, it's about um, progress for the sake of it. It's really at the heart of it about finding new um, definitions for the term and in fact that makes sense because that was stated by the um, so-called founders of the term we're not really the founders but you know the gods of it at the current moment VNV um, when they put together this definition and their dissertation and whatnot the uh, discussion they said they wanted people to have their own definitions of it. Um, they wanted it to be continually evolving. And I'm almost wondering if you could make a case that the both end actually um, is what enables progress. Like I'm just thinking aloud here, but like having the both having hmm, uh, multiple personas at once in comparison. Um, actually, the dialogue and exchange between them kind of moves time forward um, because it's not even the combination of them together that is foreseen that will cause something drastic. It's actually the combination of them together working together then creates something new. 
I think that's really, oh my God, I think that's really what the wholeness is all about. It's about arriving, it's about going from point A to point B. It's really about being changed inside some way. Um, it's about the um, process of developing and understanding. Um, Metamodernism is a movement for the sake of it. And I think whenever you lose track, you just kind of have to divert back to the term itself, which will never be static. I think that's about it right now.